<laughs> Thought it felt rain. <laughs> Let's get going. That was a pigeon. Sorry. <laughs> oh, no. Anyway. This show is going to have to have so much editing. <laughs> so, hey. It's all her fault. Watch at your own risk. Life with God is so good. It's good to be good. It's good to We're so be thankful kind. that you're here with us and joining us on the show, Life, Gwen, and Joe. I could truly say I'm glad I found you. I looked at you. We see God in everything. All of my trouble. Together, we'd like to help you fall more in love with God. I could say I'm going to see all of our experiences, all the things that we do, and places we go, and people we hang with. And it is going to be something that helps us all focus more on God. In the meantime, we're going to fall in love more with God, and our lives are going to be blessed. Good to be with you. So come join us on this fun life where we put God in the center of everything. It's a beautiful day here in Tennessee. It's Life with Gwen and Joe. This is my incredibly beautiful wife, Aww. incredibly classy wife, Gwen. And we're here for another day of talking about how good God is. And today's topic is going to be... It's going to be about bringing laughter back into your life, back into your marriage, back into everything, bringing God's laughter. You know, there's all kind of laughter out there. I hadn't thought about that, but you know, there's laughter that is laughing at people and then there's laughter, laughing with people. And uh, sometimes <laughs> I get confused <laughs> on my laugh. <laughs> Are you laughing with me or at me? <laughs> Always with you. Thank Always. you, sweetheart. I'm laughing with you, too. <laughs> you know, some of the things that brings joy into my life is when we get to go dancing, when we're out of the, like the cabin. Sometimes it's just the two of us. You know, we're around people all the time, and that is so much fun, yeah. but it's... That, that quiet time you talk about, you've talked me into getting still before God and so, like that restoration helps bring all that cheerfulness and joy and everything back into your life. Sometimes we're just playing a simple card game. I mean, just, just the little things in life I appreciate. I mean, and just even getting to go out to eat with you brings joy and... Psalm 68, three, it says, may the righteous be glad and rejoice before God. May they be happy and joyful. I'll tell you one thing that brings joy is when we get on the scales and he weighs more than I do. Which is a rare. Is that the good kind of laughter or the bad kind of laughter? That's... <laughs> That's uh... I'm, sorry. I'm sorry, I'm gonna try to get it together um, so we can get some content into the show. <laughs> Some actual real content, meaningful content. Okay, sometimes I do think maybe I've got a problem because I mean, I can't stop laughing. He's so funny and you know, he he's She can stop to... laughing, okay, don't laugh. Okay. Look at me and don't laugh. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be good. I will tell you that you make it fun by chasing me and tickling and we love to joke around she she's a really good sport she puts up with my my weirdness and my my uh bizarreness at times and she's she's such a good sport and uh, we have a good time you know what else is funny to me how god created certain things that are very contagious like when you see somebody yawn sometimes you want to yawn or whenever you see somebody really have a good belly laugh <laughs> It makes you, it's contagious and other people want to, they might not know what you're laughing about, but if you see somebody really laughing about something, it makes you kind of want to laugh along. Like watch right now, I'm going to laugh and see what, cha watch what happens to Gwen. <laughs> <laughs> see, I can't stop once you even change the mood. I mean, so I, I don't know. <laughs> laughing just feels good. Doesn't it feel good? It feels good. A belly laughter, things like that are good for the bones and they're good for a cheerful heart. And I think God kind of configured our hearts that way. To want to laugh, it makes you feel good. It brings you out of any of the things that might be stressing you out or whatever. 
And um, so that's why we always appreciate people who are really funny. Because yeah, we, we choose that. We were looking for a good laugh and we have got some friends, oh my word, that are we gotta, hilarious. We got to bring up our good friend and brother, Daniel Baker. What the fuck say? Daniel Baker's funny. Ted Anger, oh my word. Ted Anger, yeah. Ted Anger. He, he literally, I mean, you know, there's a such thing as a court jester. I mean, people that really know how to lighten the hearts. I mean, kings used to pay for it. So people go to stand up comedian type shows and yeah. you don't even have to pay for it. It's your children. Nine times out of 10, your kids make you laugh. Okay, you want to talk about circumstances? The scripture that you, you just read? You should be uh, thankful in all circumstances. In all circumstances. Because it's God's will it's for God's you. It's God's will. I've had to learn how to not let, not to carry things throughout the day. There might be a situation in the morning that was, that didn't go the way I wanted it to or things aren't working out well. And, and um, through your great example and just, just kind of praying about things, uh, these days it's, it's, it's much easier for me to realize that that's my test and I'm supposed to be thankful for that test and God expects me to work through it and, and see it as a blessing ultimately. That has really helped me get through some of the more difficult scenarios. You know, some of the practical things that, you know, God's taught me over the years, sending funny gifs or just an upbeat text. I think texting is just an amazing gift from God and I love it when you send me something funny or you send me a something sweet that cheers me up and you find something joyful or something lighthearted in so much of life and that's that's a true gift that you've got and it's it's fun to be around the people that are lighthearted and then um you've told me before that you're grateful that i'm not dramatic that i don't bring drama into the marriage and uh, we're <clears throat> you're very very even keeled with with stuff gwen deals with a lot of pressure that that comes from multiple angles all day long and I have so much respect for you. I'm in awe of this lady with with God. with with the things that she deals with on a daily basis that cover a wide spectrum of, of topics and issues and uh, you really are an amazing lady. No, God is amazing. There's you know there the only reason I would have any any contribution at all is that I know the God uh, and I'm reaching out to the God for his words to come and just as you do we we pray we pray for you guys. We love you guys. We thank you for all your support. Y'all encourage us. That's a beautiful thing. We're very we thankful. We like to read it. Very thankful for so, you. You know, that, that encourages us, those words. But um, God, we're reaching out to God and it's, God's got the sense of humor. So that's where it's all coming from because he puts it into puppy dogs. I mean, look at these puppy dogs. They're laughing. The dolphins are laughing. All of nature and creation, the trees it says in the Bible are clapping their hands. You know, and so we see the, the wind blowing right now and the, the, the leaves are clapping their hands for God. And so I know heaven's gonna be fun. He's gonna have it, he's gonna have it fun. It's gonna be the ultimate uh, little adventure and um, amusement park and all those things wrapped into one. But, but while we're here in these earthly bodies, he has given us an incredible playground. And I'm thankful that God instilled in me. He's given me so much passion. I love nature, I love animals. I love going out and, and exploring and whether it's going into the forest or going down you know, into the ocean uh, or going up into these uh, incredible skies that he gave us, this beautiful sky today, look at that. It's beautiful. And uh, I just, I appreciate the, the smaller things, the older I get, the, the less it takes to intrigue me because I can see just, just in one of these leaves down here, the, the molecular structure of, uh, of just a leaf on a tree, the, the cellular structure. If you get up close to it, it's, it's like this amazing design that God put together. It goes deeper and deeper, doesn't it? Yep. It's amazing. He's given us eyes and ears to hear. Music makes me happy. Absolutely. Lots of music. I mean, uh, that's one thing we keep going over here. Uh, if you're around us, uh, and you come in and to visit us if you walk in you're going to hear you're going to hear some music somewhere we've got speakers that's one thing we did invest in and we've got speakers all the way around the house for outside inside the pool house i mean you know we like to keep it going we love to kick the rugs back and dance dance here at the house and um 
and invite the kids over and some friends. There's some amazing events that take place here at the house, whether it's a wedding or it's a, um, a blessing shower or a baby shower or just uh, the guys or the girls getting together a nice party or some of the leadership from the church. And this is a, this is a very blessed place here. Yeah, it so. is, God has blessed us. So we're gonna end this show with a joke. Go ahead. Oh my goodness. <laughs> what do you call a cow with no legs? <laughs> I don't know what. Ground beef. Oh, get out. That's hilarious. That's funny. I'll tell you what, I'm feeling very, very thankful. Very, very blessed here. And I'll tell you what, we, we appreciate you all tuning in. Uh, we, we love doing this. I've learned to love it very much because I feel like we're, we're reaching out to our brothers and sisters. I get to spend time with my, my beautiful wife here. And we're just very, very thankful that you would spend this time with us. And if you have any questions or you have any comments, please don't forget to send them in. We'd be happy to try and answer those on the air. And we're praying, we're praying for our brothers and sisters, right? Yes, we are. Bring laughter back into everywhere you are. It'll, it'll just change your whole life. So, Absolutely. great being with you guys. Love See you so ya. much. God bless. With you, I look at my friends, the people around me, but all I need is your love to surround me. I can say I'm so I'd say, what do you think about, like, your foot? Do you think maybe you uh, like try not to. I feel comfortable shooting like this. Like front and center. So, like, you say you're not satisfied? Well, guess what? <laughs> was that, that was funny, right? It was funny. I to thought me. it was very funny. <laughs> I'm a funny guy, but looks aren't everything. <laughs> okay, we're ready to go, apparently. I gotta sing, I gotta sing, I am a happy.